So for this video guys, I'm going to be doing another reaction to Tom Segura and this one is Life is Long So let's check out the clip. We'll have a little discussion after but let's see if it's any funny. Let's go You guys are you ever just tired of being alive? You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> I'm not suicidal. I just feel like I've done a lot and I've seen a lot and now I'm like, you know, like Let's wrap this shit up like, <laughs> Right, like, how many fucking days are there? <laughs> I want to skip a grade. Remember <laughs> elementary school? You get to, like, the first day of whatever, third grade, and you're like, where's Brian? And they're like, he skipped. Like, Excuse me? <laughs> how? And they're like, he can add, like, a motherfucker. I don't know. He's just <laughs> four, eight, twelve. He gets it. And then you go, I want to skip. And they're like, <laughs> don't even think about that. Think about other shit. <laughs> I'd love to skip in real life. That would be the best program. Like if they were like, all right, if you kill it this year, you have the best year. At the end of the year, a magical fairy or a government official will come to your house. <laughs> and they go, you crushed it this year. And you're like, yeah, I know. <laughs> And then they're like, now you can skip as many years as you want. I'd be like, what the fuck? <laughs> really? Mm hmm How many do you want to skip? 30? <laughs> Just land at retirement? I don't want to live much longer than that anyways. 70, maybe 71, you know? 70 so I can be officially old and experience old guy stuff, like people talking to me like I'm a pet. And um, <laughs> you ever see that when they're like, hey, hey, how you doing? <laughs> You said, would you like me to get you anything? <laughs> like, yeah, put some water in my bowl. What the fuck is this shit? Like, <laughs> but I don't want to live much longer than that. I mean, I hear people in conversation go like, I want to live to be 100. Really? Have you seen 80? I mean, my dad has a friend that's 87. He looks like a goblin, okay? <laughs> he is terrifying to look at. And he knows it. He's like, I'm coming around the corner. Don't look at me. He knows it. It's scary. Here's how much it sucks to be that old. When he was 84, he stopped taking his heart medication. And I go, why'd you do that? He goes, I don't want to be here. But if you see him now, you're like, how are you doing? He'll go, unfortunately, alive. But he won't take me. The only thing I have going for me with that old stuff is that I will be the best old guy. I already know it. Like, I have their personality. I'm antisocial as shit. I don't want to do anything. Like, <laughs> whenever anybody says to me, like, hey, man, do you want to go check out the... I go, no to the rest of your sentence. Whatever it is, <laughs> I don't want to do it. I don't want to meet new people. Not one more as long as I live for the rest of my life. <laughs> That's the same as old people. You can try it if you want. Be like, hey, Grandpa, I want you to meet Steve. And he'll go, fuck Steve. <laughs> I know everybody I need to know. I'm going to watch my shows. <laughs> you know what I really want? I want to be that old. I don't know if it's an age. It's just a way of being old. There's a certain level of old where you get yelled at for trying to be helpful. That looks awesome. <laughs> You know what I mean? It's like when an old guy's like, I'm going to take out the trash. And someone's like, are you out of your fucking mind? Your spinal snap. Sit down. Like, okay. I tried. I'm sorry. That looks amazing. I really want that old guy confidence that I see in the locker room. Yeah, that's another thing. Dude, another thing I've noticed since joining the gym, there's two types of guys. Guys that are 65 and older, and then guys that cover their dicks. Because <laughs> old guys do not. It's crazy. The first few days, I thought it was peacocking, like showing off, you know? Because I saw some fucking hammers, like where you walk in and you're like, whoa, yeah. I wouldn't wear pants either. Nice work, pal. 
But then, like the third day, I saw a guy, and he had just like the, the cutest little thing. <laughs> And he was just like, all on the, he was like, uh, oil prices are crazy right now. <laughs> I'm like, dude, you have a little grain of rice. You don't give a shit? He didn't. He didn't care. I want that confidence. I don't even know how it's attainable. Like, if I know anyone's going to see it, dude, I'm going to, you know, <laughs> give it a smack. <laughs> And then you go, huh, there's an inch. <laughs> Let's not act like I'm the only self-fluffer in the room, okay? <laughs> Ladies, if you've ever received a dick pic before, um, here's some secret intel. That's not the first shot. <laughs> Pretty much goes like this. Click. Fuck that. And then... <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's me. That's all me right there. That's me. <laughs> God, sweating my fucking balls off like a preacher. Amen. All right. So. <laughs> hey, guys, another great Tom Sakura skit. I really enjoy his, his uh, stand-up, whether it's the way he delivers it, his material, the way he's able to tell stories, I just really enjoy something about Tom Segura. I'm not sure what it is, but uh, I'm going to get through all of his skits pretty much. Just bear with me, guys. It may take a little bit of time, but I'm going to get through them. So if you enjoy his stuff, hit the like button because it helps the channel out a lot. It helps me out a lot. Leave a comment in the comment section what other Tom Segura stuff you guys want to see. But I'm going to wrap this video up and not take up too much of your time, guys. So take care of yourself. Stay safe because it is a crazy world and there are a lot of crazy people. But most importantly, guys, peace.